Zach Greinke goes toe-to-toe with Michael Pineda on Tuesday night, and Greinke has struggled big time in Arizona this year, going 1-3 in, in five home starts. In the second inning, he faced Darlin Castro, who was feeling powerful. This is hit way high. Take a lead. Let's see if Ahmed can tie this game. That's three hits now in two innings off Pineda. Check it third. The pitch to Ahmed. And a ground ball. Base hit left field. And Pineda really upset. Owing oh. scores to tie the ball game on the RBI single by Ahmed. Well, you have set the table right now for Goldie. Now this is where you want those big hits. And here's a pitch. And a line drive. Base hit left field. Here comes Segura around third. Gardner up with it. He'll concede the run, throws to third. RBI single for Goldie, who's two for two. And the Diamondbacks shoot on top, two to one. Two men on, here's a pinch. And a base hit to left. Rounding third base, Herman. He'll come to the plate. The throw is gonna be not in time. And it's three to one Diamondbacks on the RBI hit by Castillo. Six strikeouts for Greinke, who has now set down ten consecutive Yankees. And for Greinke, that's two in the inning, six of the ball game, two up, two down in the fifth. High drive, deep right center by Lamb. Did he get all of it? Back at the wall. It's gone. Another pull shot for Lamb. Two run homer and a 5-1 Diamondback lead. That looked almost exactly where he hit last night, right in the pool area. A cannon. He is loving that cleanup spot, and he is cleaning up. Brad Singler, the Diamondbacks closer, comes on. He will face McCann, followed by Castro and Headley here in the ninth. Dean Segura. Diamondbacks win it, and they win a series at home at Chase Field as Ziggler shuts the door on the Yankees 5-3. Granke last seven innings. He gives up five hits and three runs. He struck out seven batters and locked down his fourth win of the season. Michael Pineda takes his fifth loss of the season. He went five innings, gave up nine hits and five runs. His ERA this year is 6.6. .6. The D-backs will go for the sweep on Wednesday.